Maya Gavana, Melanine, and well met indeed. I'm Erica Galdritten, the head of Divide and Conquer. And here I'm going to show you something that we've been working on behind the scenes. This is going to go up before the Veil of Andrew Infection overview. So I allude to this in the, uh, in the overview, but you will have seen it already. And I just desperately want to show it off because I am very, very pleased with it. And now it's not final that this unit's going to get it. This was just who I gave it to as testing. And we're up against just a force of Anduin, uh, of Dole Amroth, just because we can be. They're the first unit in the roster to take the second slot uh, of Dole Amroth. So, this came about because somebody in the comments section said that they'd done this um, to get a unit that they called Spider Hunters. Goblin Spider Hunters. And I like the idea so much I wanted to take it on. And I spoke with Hummingbird and he liked the idea as well. So, this, when they fire, is what we have at the moment. Now, as I say, it, wait, it might not be on this unit. Um, in fact, it definitely won't. We think we'll probably put it on the snagger units. But it is poison arrows. And that is the effect that it has. As you can see, every arrow that hits a person leaves behind this small poisonous cloud for approximately, I think it's about 10 seconds. Um, there's no special extra identifying noise. It doesn't linger enough to slow down your game or anything like that. And it's gone by the time they fire their next wave. But with every hit, poison flies forth from the arrowhead. And in, if you're worrying about it just being cosmetic, it is not at all. Um, whilst there's still some tinkering I need to do, and that's what I hope to do this very evening, but the effect is to lower the morale of the unit that it hits by five. It's five points of morale lowered, essentially for that whole unit, um, and it will last as long as they're being shot. It lasts. The effect at the minute will last for about 20 seconds. So as long as the unit is constantly under fire, they will have their morale constantly reduced by a fixed penalty of five. And if they bunch up like that, they will get it reduced to five constantly. And it will just impress upon you the need to close in on the Misty Mountains more so than ever. Uh, it does just fade away. I'm very, very pleased to have added this effect and I hope you all like it as much as I have done. And I implore you to please leave comments, let me know what you think about that effect and let me know if you think we can adjust it or twist it in any way. The units that are probably going to get it are the Misty Mountain Snaggers, the Dol Guldor Stalkers. Um, oh, I just shut him up. I don't know if it has the microphone as well, actually. The Dol Guldor Stalkers, the Misty Mountain Snaggers, and potentially these crossbowmen as well, as they're the elite of the Misty Mountains. Uh, but it'll be a Misty Mountain feature to poison their enemies before they go into battle, thus reducing the enemy's willpower. So let me know what you think of the effect. But for now, that's all for this one. So thank you very much for watching. And until we speak again, Nevaya Naden Peremad Melonin, and fare thee well.